Uh, you're watching and listening to Mark from MarkSefton.com. And what I'm doing, I'm doing a series of short little videos on YouTube and just taking you on a journey through my first book, Inside Job. And the third chapter is really about what are you feeding your mind? Your mind is a muscle. Uh, I've talked before about mind obesity, that what you feed your mind really will determine its strength. You know, when life throws you a curveball, when life is difficult, do you have the mental stamina and ability to be able to journey through and pivot and evolve beyond the challenges that life brings? And the whole premise of Bread for the Head is really, where are you stimulating your brain? How are you growing it? You know, we go into the gym and we work our muscles in our arms, our legs, our biceps, but what are we doing to work our mind? You know, how are we exercising our mind? What are we doing to cultivate and strengthen that creativity and that ability that when in the face of problems, we don't fall flat on our face, but we see the opportunity that we grow bigger than the problem. And the whole premise of Bread for the Head is really helping you find areas in your life that are actually really good for you, that nurture you, and it reveals some of the areas in our life that actually we need to stay away from. Things like the news that pollute, that cover us in fear. You know, the voices that we listen to, believe in somebody else's story, they all affect our mind. You know, and I talk about different principles and practical strategies where you can feed your head bread and you give it that nourishment and you give it that strength and you have that clarity. So when life is tough, because it is for all of us, it's both beautiful and beautiful, we know how to journey beyond that. You can find out more about me at MarkSefton.com and you can jump onto Amazon. You can find this on Kindle, paperback and Audible. And I'd love to hear from you. Comment below.